just do what I got to do. I'm going to just take care of me. I'm not about to take care of no man. That are like, what are your thoughts about that type of I mean, situation? Bob, you want to go first? Um, no, I, I think you should go first. Man. <laughs> I think that it's not a black man thing. I think, and this is going to sound really bad. I don't mean for it to sound bad. I think that all came about when, how can I put this in a gentle way, man? No, say what you gotta say. I'm I'm open. I'm 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 here. Like when the when the equal rights. Uh oh, see that? See, you read Uh-oh. my mind, brother. Okay, go hey, ahead. Brother. When that came about, like, it, and it wasn't it wasn't really for black women. It was more of the other races that wanted to have the equal rights because mm-hmm. they, you know, they wouldn't even hire they were they, they weren't even hiring black men back in the day type of thing. You know what I mean? Right. So I feel like that's where it came from. And then it just spawned into some, okay, well, you know what I mean? I can get a job now, too. I can get, I can go to school. I can just, not saying that women should go to school and have good jobs. I'm not saying that. It just became more of a emasculating of the man. And now you're, you're, you're downplaying the role of the man in your household type of mm, thing, man. Okay. You know what I mean? So. Okay. I'm, I got thoughts for that, but I'm going to wait till Bob go. She, 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 oh, my God. I'm not. I'm I'm gonna... I feel like that mindset comes from. That scenario when you know um you know the feminist the woman the woman um women's, women's movement I forgot what it's called yes original and all that when that came about and you know basically the section eight thing came into play and the man couldn't be in a home right. or it was, it, that didn't create an environment for like single motherhood right. and, you know the the man not being in the picture so like that that that's the cycle that's where the cycle began really it wasn't it, 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 you know it, that's how it occurred that's how it happened basically. But okay, so my, and that's what women, women became. The women were put in a position where they had to, mm-hmm. you know, rely on the smart yours, rely on the government. Yeah, you, they had to, like, you mean, like, you know, had to get, they had to go to, they had to go to college and and, and, right. and work and do all of that. You know what I'm saying, like, to, to provide for their um, their family. Right. So my thoughts. So I was listening to him and I and I agree up until a, per, a certain a certain extent. Right. Like we could go all the way back. I literally go back to slavery because I honestly feel like men, black men were emasculated during slavery, long time straight ago. up long time ago, even before women's rights, literally humiliated in front of their wives to show that they were not a man one. And then, you know, as a woman in and during slavery time, you couldn't expect your man to be a man because you knew he was going to get in trouble. You knew he was going to get hurt. And so you had to kind of take on this role of being a quote unquote housewife and being a leader of the house, being a leader of the house, because he has been emasculated. His literally without being, um, without being in reality, his boss was just taken from him straight up. His manhood was stripped from him to, 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 to show the master quote unquote, that he is not a person. He is not a, a, a human being. And then, on top of that, the woman being taken by the masters as their women, yeah. their nursing their babies, da da da, like all of this stuff. I honestly think that it goes back even beyond then, right? It goes back to that point. And then, you know, women grew up, black women, we grew up in, in that, right? I have to provide for my family. Yeah, my husband out there work in the fields, but I'm in his household. And then when he too hurt or he got beat or whatever, I got to take care of him. I got to do this, blah, 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 blah. Mm-hmm. So that extended. And then it came and, you know, now you're in modern modern times. And then it's, I think that mindset of emascula- emasculation has just stuck. And I think, honestly, I can say, the only thing I could think of is a generational curse. Like, it's yeah. just literally been instilled and then the system like you already explained didn't do no better having to rely on section eight you could be married and the man still can't be in the house with you that happened to one of my clients in this day and age and when i was a social worker she was married to the man and he could not move in or she could not get the funds that she needed to to live and so um obviously he was still in the house but it, it, it just sucked and then i was trying to kind of get some more information people was giving me to run around and as a social worker you don't have enough time to kind of fight the system um but what the guy was saying right in that men creating these situations where women have to be responsible i know people always say to the women oh well you don't want a baby get on birth control blah 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 but i think women are so emotional 
we are so emotional. We are such emotional creatures that we honestly feel like there are women that honestly feel like I'm gonna give him a baby. He gonna change, or I'm gonna love him enough. Yeah. He gonna be this person. I think it. Men can take that back. Men can take some type of masculinity back and be like, bro, I'm not having sex with you unless you buy, unless you want a pill, or I'm gonna get in a condom. Like they can make that determination. This yeah. guy. He, the guy on the uh, podcast was like, he got two baby moms, and he, the guy was like, yo, you got two baby moms out there, and you didn't marry none of them, and he, and he, he literally was like, I had no intention. You have no intention of marrying these two women. Why get them pregnant? Why be so reckless? Uh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, I, 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 I got to cut you off. You're uh, switching, switching it up now. You're switching yeah, it up. Yeah, because I, I don't like this blame, this yeah. blaming men for single uh, motherhood thing. Why? Why, why not? Go ahead. Tell me it, why. Because it's a woman's decision. It's her body, right? To bring a, a baby a, in the world, bring right? Bring forth life. Right? So if you don't, if you, there's, there's too many precautionary things to do. Yes, for, for both for, for both for men, for men yeah. and women, right? But women, women are the ones that give give men access. A man can't, a man can't just. I mean, a man can do that, you know, that's rape, rape. Or whatever. Right, that's but that's called rape. rape. No, no, no. But in a can. in a monogamous, uh, consensual relationship. Yeah, I'm talking about yeah. Both parties. Yeah. Have the right. It's, but. Here it here, here it is. It's a woman have to control. Men have men have control of relationships, marriage, and all that. Women have control of sex, and children. You know what I'm saying? So, I mean, there's too many different. There's too many things to prevent you from having. You know I mean, that's why they say marry before you care. You supposed to marry before you carry, really? Right, right. That's the you ideal saying? thing, right? You should, but. You should lay down. You like, hey, if you if you want I, this right I don't, here, I don't, I don't subscribe to that at all. Just, I mean, you don't subscribe to that at all. I mean, you don't have to subscribe to it, but I mean, are you gonna just have babies? Are you gonna be? Do you want to just have babies everywhere, or do you? What do you, what do, you do? But that's what I'm talking about, Bob. That's exactly what I'm talking. If we're talking, if we're talking, talking about, about, if we're talking about a biblical sense, once you know her, once you know her, you're technically married. You know what I mean? So no, that's, that's not what that says. It is. That's what it is. That's what exactly it is. There's no marriage. I, 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 used, to subscri- I used to subscribe to that, man. Those are, those are period <laughs> where I subscribe to that, man. Bro, that's what it is, man. You get her demons, she gets your demons, and that's just what it is. That's just a soul tie, sweetheart. That's just Which a, is, and what is marriage? marriage, though. Marriage is you're tying your soul for life, you uh, know, quote unquote, hopefully for life, to somebody I mean, technically, else. Technically, you, technically, technically, you're correct. You're, yeah. you're correct about that. You know what I mean? It's the whole sexual act. That's why you're supposed to. Women, I mean, um, back in the days, women were virgins and stuff like that. Right. For marriage, mm-hmm. for marriage and everything. Yeah, exactly. And if, if but it, um, men protected. But men purity. also, men also protected women's pureness and, and innocence back in the day. If you Father. honestly like those, mm-hmm. they were men. Yes, they were men. The father, the, the father's not just the fathers, but even on dates. Like if a girl's skirt went up, a dude turning his face, like he or or putting his coat. If because if it actually uh, yes, what time period are. is this? What yeah, time I, I would go time. Back, I don't know back in the day, this is like the fit when dates was like under trees. Because even David, nah, even, David like, even, even 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 David in the Bible collected, uh, committed adultery, right? What so he, he did too. I'm not saying that adultery and no and in any time was not a thing. Okay. I mean, adultery happened in all of the ages of the of the time, like in all ages. But I'm just saying, standards were different. Men protected nah, women. Nah, I can I keep that. Women, well, obviously, days, they didn't date back in those days. There was no dating back in those days. You called dating. it woman. Dating. You know what I'm like they, they didn't go out on dating. There wasn't no um, going out. That dating thing is a whole. That's a whole new thing. Okay. It was called process. courting, but they didn't just court one woman either. It wasn't just one person that they was like, "Oh, I know I'm gonna marry this person at 16." No, they courted multiple different women, and then they started dating that one woman that nah, they thought... They didn't date. They didn't, I'm telling you, they didn't date. They, look up dating. It was look, called courting. Look it up. Okay, oh my gosh. You can look it up. Dating is a whole... Dating Yo, to me, so let me, me uh, right. dating is what me, is what's messing the game up right now. Back well, in the day, no, dating. it's not dating. Dating. So is you want a Netflix and chill? Sex is messing no, the game. I'm, I'm not saying Netflix, Netflix and chill. I'm saying like, they courted women back... That's why it worked out back in the day. You courted a woman. You're saying it was it, it was there was different there was a there was Look a whole different way of um, dating. Yeah, look it up. Look it up. Listen, uh, before I bring this guest in because she oh. texted me like crazy, um, let me ask the question, right? And it's kind of it's kind of like off the wall a little bit, but I heard the oh. story a little while a little while ago. Basically, the story is, you know, a a couple 
<coughs> a small child, like an infant type of child, they left a small child with the babysitter, right? They came back home to, you know, at the date, was there, you know, whatever they did, whatever was done, and they caught the babysitter breastfeeding the child. Oh, I'm fighting somebody. Straight up. I'm punching you in your face. That's an issue? Yes. Why is it an issue? You are, first of all, why would you be, <laughs> really? Really, why is your nipple in my child's mouth? Did we have a conversation that said, did my baby run out of food? Yeah, did you call did. me and said and yeah. say your child has no food left? Yeah, no, nah, it wasn't it wasn't a thing. I will literally fight you. But what's the issue though? What if the mother what if she had AIDS? I don't think she would be that irresponsible. To, I mean That's irresponsible in and of itself to do it without any type of permission, any type of anything. Why why is that even a thing? Why like the only, to me, the only reason to do that, to go behind my back and do something like that was for some type of personal satisfaction. Okay. And not like sexual satisfaction, but personal satisfaction. Like, well, don't, oh, don't the, 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 everything gets like, uh, what was the word I'm looking for? It's the pressure on the, on the nipples and all that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Like, so if she was, if she was, she, she should have brought her pump. Where's your pump? Why? And, and then why the heck are you not at home with your baby? Mm hmm. If you are a breastfeeding mom, why are you not? Why are you not with your baby? Bob, if you came home, that is you weird. Saw, you saw your little son. <laughs> yeah, I'm saying on the babysitter. That's the issue. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> that's the issue. For me personally, it, it goes by. If it was a girl, I'd probably be mad. I'd probably be mad. If it was a boy, I probably won't be too mad. Exactly. What yeah. the heck is wrong with y'all? <laughs> yeah, yeah. But I would have to, like, if my wife is there, or whatever, act like woman's it. there, I have to act like I'm mad or whatever, you know what I'm saying? I'll be like, I'll be like, I'll that myself. What's wrong with y'all? <laughs> That's my little man right there, man. Go ahead, boy. Y'all so Go dirty, y'all. <laughs> uh, oh, my God. They, they gotta worry about him. They ain't gotta worry about him growing up, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, you know, exactly. No, he, you know where he gonna be going, man. He gonna, exactly. Here, here that don't it. mean nothing. Yeah, that nah, 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 nah. I 100% think. I, I 100% believe in my heart. If my son was getting, if he was sucking on um a babysitter's a nipple or whatever, yeah, yeah, he's not gonna grow up to be that. He's not gonna no. grow up to be that way. I don't think, man. There's no way. There's no that way. There's no way in the world, man. There is no it's it's oh not gonna God. be his DNA. That's going into his DNA, man. You know what I'm saying? He may not remember that moment. Uh, it's gonna be, it's gonna there be is no man. sexuality. <laughs> there is no sexuality when he a baby. He don't. He not thinking of no sex when he. I'm I'm telling you that, I don't know. It has an effect. Oh, oh, I don't know. Smallest things no, have an effect on, on, on children, man. You know what I'm saying? I that I agree.